and it's lights out and away we go. Leclerc and Perez get away well. Hamilton behind Leclerc wanting to get on with it as is Pierre Gasly in the Alpha Tauri and Sergio Perez leads them into the first corner as he did in Baku. Hamilton goes wide. Carlos Sainz will slip through into third place. Lando Norris putting pressure on Lewis Hamilton. Fernando Alonso has lost places one by one. They're all making their way round. Max Verstappen looks to have got bogged down a little bit and lost places going into turn one. We now make the turn right-handed and onto the Raffles Boulevard and it's a long straight towards the next left-hander and you can see the spray coming up there but nothing to interfere with Sergio Perez's view. He's out in front. Lando Norris has a look at Lewis Hamilton around the outside. Fernando Alonso keeping Pierre Gasly at bay and that looks like Kevin Magnussen and the Haas going off and it looks like a Williams of Nicholas Latifi, I think, or Alex Albon who has gone off at turn seven and was going backwards down the escape road. Lewis Hamilton had a helping hand off the road um, in turn two by Carlos Sainz at the start. Verstappen's getting his elbows out and I think he might have made contact with the back of Lance Stroll's Aston Martin and once again losing more places. That's Danny Ricciardo making his way past Max Verstappen. Verstappen on the inside will now try and get that place back again and he does. Verstappen not having an easy start here. Worth pointing out, Sebastian Vettel in eighth place. Tremendous start uh, from him in his final Singapore Grand Prix. His teammate Lance Stroll under pressure now from Max Verstappen, who slides down the inside and moves his Red Bull up into the top ten. Joe Guan Yu, uh, who has stopped on the track. This is at turn five. Oh, hit the wall, and Latifi hitting the wall too. The guy just fully squeezed me into the wall, guys. I don't know what is he doing. Copy, John, I've seen it. Safety oh, car. Safety got the full safety car as well. Green flags waving. Perez from uh, Leclerc, from Sainz, from Hamilton, from Norris. There's Alonso. And then comes Gasly and Vettel. And Max Verstappen once again right on Sebastian Vettel's tail. And Verstappen certainly wasn't caught a napping at the uh, start of the uh, uh, race once again. He was very much on his toes and trying to get past Sebastian Vettel. And has he had a little look down the inside, I wonder? Yes. He has got ahead of Sebastian Vettel. Max Verstappen up into eighth place where he started the race. Max Verstappen a long, long way uh, from thinking about how to celebrate a second world title. Uh, to give it some more thought, he goes down the inside and onto the Esplanade Bridge and he finds himself ahead of Pierre Gasly. Verstappen and Alonso uh, just swapping places there. We've now got a yellow flag uh, out there on the track too in the Alonso stopped. middle part of the lap as Fernando Alonso stops. Copy. Ooh, Yuki. You go slightly offline, and that's on Inters. You go slightly offline, and you'll be straight in the wall. This is what happened to Alex Albon. Just oh, it's one of those grip. horrible, silly shunts. He's, he's gone in, the front won't bite. He's then gone on to the wetter part of the track and then had a very pedestrian uh, just under stairs towards the wall. Oh, no. It's the gap back down to 2.7. at showing three on the top of the screen. Oh, and that's Lewis Hamilton going straight on. Hamilton frustrated behind Carlos Sainz has gone straight on and has hit the barrier down at turn seven. Norris and Verstappen coming to the scene of the accident. Hamilton rejoins the track. Norris goes through. Hamilton rejoins the race ahead of Max Verstappen. Over the bumps. Yeah. Just couldn't turn. Well, committed, didn't he, to the corner and couldn't yeah. go down the escape road. And that's the issue for Yuki Tsunoda. He's gone into the barriers at turn 10. Switch off, switch off, engine off. That could well be a full safety car. They've got to fix the barrier there. He's gone in at about 80 miles an hour, uh, Yuki Tsunoda. Uh, safety car, full safety car, has been deployed. Let's see what they've got in store for us now uh, as we race towards the chequered flag. Sergio Perez into the first corner ahead of Charles Leclerc and Carlos Sainz. Max Verstappen right up behind Lando Norris. Daniel Ricciardo comes next on the soft compound tyre. Everyone else bar Bottas is on the medium compound tyre. 
Yeah, both Red Bulls and using the straight line to try to put some energy into the tyre. You're not really losing anything down there, swinging around. And uh, you can see then Verstappen immediately with lots of confidence. Uh, behind Ricardo, Stroll, Vettel, Hamilton and Gasly complete the top ten. There goes Max Verstappen locking up his brakes and Max Verstappen goes straight on. Manages to stop in time, spins the car around 180 degrees and rejoins the race. Verstappen went for it, but were those tyres brakes too cold to make such a bold move. George What's with happened right to rear George puncture. Russell? Yeah, he's got a puncture. Has he? What the hell happened there? You turn right into him, George. He came out last after having to pit for new tyres, and Max Verstappen has just put himself into the points. He's got past Valtteri Bottas. Gazzi's on the medium compound tyre, Verstappen getting very, very racy uh, and picking up a couple of World Championship points. Next car uh, up ahead is Lewis Hamilton. Hamilton, this time having a go on Sebastian Vettel. Vettel positions his car absolutely perfectly to deny him. Hamilton, is he going to go down the inside? Has to lock up. Verstappen goes through on Hamilton. Verstappen just bided his time a little bit. Hamilton made the move on Sebastian Vettel. It didn't come off. And Verstappen said thank you very much. To the line. Oh, as Max Verstappen makes the move on Sebastian Vettel, straight line speed of the Red Bull looks pretty good if he can make it into the corner okay, and Sebastian Vettel does get uh, overtaken by Max Verstappen, who's up in the seventh place, but while he'll look at just a few points, it's going to be maximum points for Sergio Perez, who on the streets of Singapore wins the 2022 Singapore Grand Prix. This, the greatest race for Sergio Perez, Vamos, Checo! Unbelievable! What a drive! This is how we do it, man. We shut our mouth and we work hard. This is the Mexican way. Well done, guys. Well, it was the night that Max Verstappen had his first chance at winning a world championship, uh, but it was his teammate who decided to go and grab the headlines. He led every single lap of the race up to lap 48. Uh, Sergio Perez on top of the podium and having a brilliant night here in Singapore, our winner this evening.